Hello, Jeff Cork. Hey, Ben Hansen. We bought a used memory card. We're going to try and figure out what this person's life was like that used to own it. And you're done sniffing it, so now we're going to look at it. This is a PlayStation 2 memory card. We have no idea what to expect, and so let's find out what is on this old let's memory do it. card. Oh. Oh, boy. Here it comes. Oh, <laughs> okay. Oh. What a mess. Ah, oh, Sly Cooper. Good God. Big old hippo. <laughs> Oh, of okay. course, it's Final Fantasy X 2. What do you think this next one is? Um, some kind of sports game. Oh, Prince of Persia. Sands of Time. Parkour, a sport in and of itself. I mean, <laughs> if they're letting esports in. State oh, of emergency. Okay. Of course. It's when you're in 2002, that's peak two towers mm -hmm. Ah, Ghost Recon Dan. Good old Dan. I already, based on previous experience with Dan's, this guy sucks super hard. <laughs> All right. Ah, uh, good old CDS. Where do you start? The internet seems to think it's Conflict Desert Storm. Oh. It fits very well it's in line with SOCOM. absolutely that. Okay. Yeah. Ah, Deadly Alliance. The Deadliest Alliance. Sub-Zero, Scorpion. Let's pal up and, and cause some trouble. Ah, SOCOM, US Navy SEALs. Let's plug in that Ethernet port. Let's go. Yeah, Rabid Fan Base. That's what I know about that series. This is Deus Ex. This is the smart addition to this memory card yes. lineup. Max Payne. People sure like to talk about that still, don't they? Sam Lake specifically. <laughs> <laughs> now we're talking. I'm so excited to see what Dan's doing on old I strut he, a dock. He's strutting a dock. <laughs> <laughs> Does this one span two slots? Is that what's going on? It's difficult. Oh, oh it's custom <laughs> skater. That's yes. the jackpot right there. Saving that for the end. Yep. What is this last one? Oh boy, is that a ninja? Twisted oh, Metal a, Black. What? Oh. So at Game Informer, we have a vault that has every game ever made. So we can boot up any of these saves. Which ones jump out to you, Cork? Tell you what, let's just go to the vault, grab these games, and see how it goes. Okay, let's do it. All right, Metal Gear Solid 2. I don't need to see more. Dan is already the <laughs> greatest person just for reminding me how good this intro is. What's better than this intro? Name one thing, Jeff Cork. Metal Gear Solid 3. <laughs> oh, he's playing on hard. Interesting, That's, that's not easy. Okay, <laughs> this is where Dan left us. Oh no, he's trying to disarm the bombs okay. with the coolant, and he probably can't find all of them. So he has the stealth camo, which Ooh. means that he beat the game already and got a boatload of dog tags. He was pretty hardcore about it. He is extremely hardcore about this game. Also, using the trank. Let's see what conversation he was missing out with. Uh, who do you want to call? We gotta call uh, Mr. X. Okay. <gasps> Just like him. Right. All the bombs have been diffused. The so if he diffused all the bombs, it seems like he went through First, the most annoying the part. And now aid. when he's actually able to advance the plot, then he stops. Is it possible he did an all nighter and just didn't save his game again? We'll never know. Do we'll never know. I'm gonna look in the phone book yes. for Dan. <laughs> so it seems like the best way to figure out how far Dan got would be to look at what movies he's unlocked. Do you want to boot up one of these games to see how it goes? Sure. He had, It does look like he did have Yellow Jacket. Oh, we are right into it. Yep. Okay, okay. All right. We're at the last stage here. He's unlocked a couple of the, the characters. He seems to know what he's doing. I'm still Mr. Kanan's son, that's the Yellow Jacket one. But how does he not have the middle? Yeah, that is strange. Go to black. Cameras have really put up with a lot, haven't they? Oh, no. Unclear if Dan then modeled the rest of his life off of that character. I hope not. He would have to eat so many bees to get that voice. Huh. Well, we know that Dan saw one of the worst endings in Twisted Metal Black. <laughs> <laughs> Is this possible this could have been a secondary memory card for this player? Because these this pattern of games you're saying doesn't make sense, and but so it just feels like runoff? It just seems very strange to jump into as I like to call it, Final Fantasy X2, <laughs> and not have a save for the original Final Fantasy X. I think that absence of Final Fantasy X tells us a lot about Dan. Yeah. He saw the J-pop commercials and said, this is where I want in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so Here we go. Discordant with everything else we know about Dan. He's only played for four hours and 28 minutes. Someone lent him this game. Ah, uh, yes. Here we are. Dive into menus? Dive into the menus. Quick. So it's interesting, he's taking this RPG, making Yuna a gunner, mm -hmm. and then we have Pain as a warrior. Yes. So he's trying to make it as aggressive as possible. Right. Let's see. 
The, he didn't use the pacifist class for any of them. It's been too long, Lady Yuna. Yeah, it's I been Lucille, like 15 years. I think he saw this and was just like, you Jack, you. if someone like ever offers too, right? that you should join something yes, called the Youth League, no, don't. You said it. <laughs> so calm. So calm. Here's my theory with this. Yeah. He had such a great time, our, our dear friend Dan, with MGS2. He saw there's a game named after a gun <laughs> from Metal Gear Solid 2, and this comes with a headset? Hello, hello, Mr. X. <laughs> <laughs> Lieutenant Junior Grade Dan. Is he Lieutenant Junior Grade Dan? Yeah. From Forrest Gump? Gary <laughs> <laughs> Sinise. All right, Dan. This will be helpful. Map. <laughs> <laughs> Just think Dan may have looked at this with his, his own eyes and thought, guard tower. There's got to be a way to mark a river on a map. It's <laughs> beyond just writing a river. It's the mm. watery stripe. Hello, Dan. <laughs> Reporting for Dandy. This looks like an army man game. Like the little plastic soldiers. You could convince me pretty easily that you are playing as a character who's two feet tall. <laughs> for Dan! Okay. Well, that's so calm, everybody. <laughs> Everyone dies. Thanks a lot, Dan. Ah, uh, State of Emergency. Truly the Final Fantasy X-2 to GTA 3's Final <laughs> Fantasy X. Exactly. Well, look at the high scores. Oh, Ken. This is Ken's world. Dan just lives in it. These are the character names, right? Oh, probably. A lot of really great characters. No, do you think that's what that is? I don't know. Chaos? Yeah. Ah! Dan has a friend named Ken who oh. played the game a lot. A lot more than Dan did. Yeah. Or maybe it's his brother. Dan and Ken. Maybe father. Oh my goodness. And here's the real question. Who's D? Do you know Dan? Do you know Dan? <laughs> oh God. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> okay. Well, state of emergency taught us uh, we're not alone here. We got no. a Ken and we might have a D. Max Payne 1 split into three parts. Ah. We know exactly where he's at. Okay. He hasn't gotten to part three yet. Oh. He's at chapter five. Oh. Of part two, Murderous okay. Hearts. The night groaned with cold. The garden lights flickered nervously. In their light, Remember, the falling snow was dead. Good for like a noir thing, so you up. can't criticize it. Nighter. Here we go. This is him. Don't blow it. You don't have a whole lot of health. You're hurt to your pants. Dan! <laughs> it's pain! <laughs> What'd you learn about Dan? He got frustrated with this part. <laughs> Always slow motion. <laughs> I'm out of here. Ken. Both of them are loaded. D, we can cross off. Ken and Dan are the primary suspects here. Yes. Brothers or best friends. I don't know why you're going best friends. I think it has to be brothers. If you're sharing memory card, yeah. that's way too intimate for friends. Really? Okay. Yeah. Um, view go. player profile. There you go. Get out of here, Ken. All right, Dan. <laughs> now get. Conquest. Uh, he's got a perfect record of... O and O. How how does that work? But then he also has earned thirty four thousand coins. Is he only playing in conquest mode then? Yes. What is? What the f is with these brothers? It's very strange. I have to enter a code to load my profile. Oh, Do you understand that? It's to keep the brothers from messing around with uh, each other's saves. I bet. Corko, I'm meaning to ask you, do you know Dan's uh, Mortal Kombat Deadly Alliance load code? His load code? Yeah. It's a bunch of X's. Actually. Damn it, Dan. This guy locked it up and then snapped the key inside the lock. He thwarted future historians. He is a tactician. Well played, Dan. Well played. It's a Deus Ex game, it says. Yeah, no shit. This is the epitome of a Deus Ex game. It's called Deus Ex. So here's what we got, Cork. This is very odd. Okay. Area 51 is the last level of the first Deus Ex. Okay. Substation, mm -hmm. which is the last game he played. Right. His Battery Park is the opening sequence. Right. Yeah, so he would have started again. Huh. All right, well, we have to go to the end then, right? Yeah. Oh! Oh, my. Oh, God. Very nice save. <laughs> oh, <What>? my God. <laughs> okay. Hang on. Hang on. Let's. Jesus, Dan. Thanks a lot, buddy. <laughs> Thanks for nothing. Holy. 
What kind of <laughs> nightmare <laughs> is this? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. No wonder he quit this fucking game. All right, so when we load the game, you're wearing a wasp nest as a <laughs> helmet. <laughs> 40,000 points, what does that mean? I don't know. All right, let's at least figure out what Oggs he has. Yeah. He goes for muscle. Again, stealth. Yeah. Let's lock and load. Oh, here we go. Do your worst. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Dan realized that he specced his character incorrectly, got to the end, and then just decided to start over because this is such a nightmare scenario. All right, Dan, thanks a lot, buddy. <laughs> This is the mother load. This is everything. Oh, oh hello. look at this. Not bad, Dan or Ken. Custom skater. Wait a minute. Is that it? Let's see. Yes. Oh, there it is, there it Dan. Is. If you've seen this man. Rotate him, please. You think you know Dan? You might recognize him better from oh. his back tattoo. Yeah. Still got it. Look at you. Dan. <laughs> oh, my God. I see he has the gore on. There's one problem with this. What's that? Is this from a band that I know? <laughs> Someone should have a podcast about this band. <laughs> I bet it'd be very nice to listen to. All right, should we see his super good career? A Fire Inside Out on iTunes. Ah, uh, interesting. Yeah, so he has played a ton. <laughs> he's played a lot of this game. He really has. But Demonus is the one that he's working on now. So he's in the middle of it before he gave up. I think at a certain point he's like, you know what, I've done... 54 goals, probably about a dozen times. I get it. <laughs> All right, Cork, based on everything you know mm -hmm. about Dan, what do you think is going on here? It's very going to be very difficult to talk about this. Oh, I, I'm starting to lean toward you. I think he has a sibling, Ken. Ghost Recon's Dan. Yes. Dan is also so calm. Dan is more tactical. Mm -hmm. Ken, is I think Ken is a younger brother. I think Ken got this system after Dan, mm -hmm. played a ton of State of Emergency, ended up playing a ton of Sly Cooper towards the end of this system's life. Right. And maybe Final Fantasy X-2, and that's why Ken is in the Youth League. Ah, uh, that makes sense. This is a tale of two sons. It's a tale of two sons. <laughs> Do you think you could hang out with Dan? Yeah, he seems like a pretty cool guy. He seems like a really smart guy. I sincerely yeah. mean that. He has, he has like, decent taste. I think his brother is quietly maybe the star of this show. Mm -hmm. I, I think that what Dan did with Deus Ex is borderline un unforgivable, leaving you in a lurch like that. But what are you going to do? Yeah, you know, maybe we should hang out with Ken. You're right. Yeah, Ken sounds better. And if we need a fill of Dan, Ken could hook us up with some stories. We're like, okay, I get it. <laughs> Ken, secret star yeah. of this uh, memory card archaeology dig. Absolutely. Great job, Ken. Thanks for watching, everybody. Say bye. Bye. <laughs>